So congratulations to Jared Porter. Now the New York Met GM signed a four-year deal. Um, you know, uh, formerly the Arizona Diamondbacks assistant GM. Um, his background in Porter is professional scouting. Though he isn't limited to any one area, uh, in his current role there with the Diamondbacks. Prior to joining the Diamondbacks, he was director of professional scouting for the Cubs uh, for two, two seasons. A title he held with the Red Sox from 2012 to 2015. Currently, he's a senior and VP and assistant GM to Mike uh, Hazen in Arizona. A position that he's held for since just uh, after winning the World Series with the Cubs. Hazen hired Porter in November of 2016. Contributed, did Porter, he gets um, mentioned for contributions to four World Series winners, including, quote-unquote, a pair of curse breakers in Boston and Chicago. Has a reputation, quote, as being personable, hardworking, scout at heart, who knows analytics, not afraid to make decisions. Theo Epstein's disciple. So, you know, just uh, just a brief kind of summary. The credentials seem good. You know, but I wonder, you know, some of these guys working on their big GM names... Are they key contributors or just beneficiaries? Beneficiaries, you know, of being in the right situation. Listen, just because he's part of four championship uh, front offices doesn't mean that he could run a team on his own. But his resume is honestly better than what I expected the Mets to end up with. So who knows? He's going to have a rich owner, that's for sure. The question will be, will he be the owner, you know, will the, the question that we're going to look here, will the new owner run the team and then blame the GM for the owner's moves? Or are they going to actually, actually let him run the show? Or does Sandy Alderson run everything who knows that hasn't been fully answered lots of questions lots of questions you know this is a, a classic kind of touch to magic hire there are only a handful of Epst epstein's friedman's uh in, in baseball but every team wants to kind of touch the magic so they attempt to snatch up their under, you know, underliers, under guys. Yeah, it's like football Nick Saban. Think about it. There are 30 GM positions in baseball, right? How many of those positions are, you know, filled by people who have worked under those three? What, 12? So... Uh, that that's the that's the hard, uh, hot uh, hot hot market right there right now, so let's see uh, what happens here for Mr. Porter and the New York Mets. Hope all is well.